Hi, welcome. In today's video, I'll be talking about Tableau's special function, make point and make line. These uh, special functions are really helpful when you are using, if you want to do special analysis or if you want to draw uh, between special points. In today's demo, I'll be using a data set which has a list of countries and I will select randomly one of them as origin country and the rest all as my destination countries. And I will we'll draw this, uh, we'll develop this uh, visualization. Let's see the data. Uh, I have a list of countries. Um, my data set has a list of countries and its latitude and longitude. So randomly I will select with parameterization. I will select one of the country as my origin country and rest all will be my destination countries. And uh, in your data set, you might have uh, your source and target uh, country information. For example, this uh, these functions can be used if you want to do some kind of a special analysis, like for example, the flights, uh, if you want to see the flights, how it is connecting from one uh, origin to the destination, or if you have pick up, pick up and uh, drop off data, like for, for, like for taxis, you can use this function. So first thing is I'll create a parameter. Let's name it as select origin. And I'll get lists from the countries. So this one of them will be my origin. And then we need to create our uh, origin points and destination points. To do that, uh, just to save time, I have created these functions. Uh, we will we'll use the make point to create our special uh, special points. So in Tableau, we have a speeding team. Let let me copy all these, and I'll just create a temporary parameter connections then if you just drag and drop this it will create a calculated functions for me so my origin is uh, the make point takes two, two values the, the latitude and longitude or a xy coordinate with its sari id sari id is basically the coordinate uh, system uh, id uh, since i want since i'm in my data i'm taking the origin from the same data set so i'm using a uh, fixed LOD so that it isolates this from the rest of my destinations. So once I create the origin, my destination will be like all those other points. So I'll just drag this. And then uh, to create a line between two special points, we'll use the make line function. Make line function creates, if you see the description, it creates a line between these two special points. So with these three functions, we are ready. So all we have to do is just double click this and we have our uh, arcs between our my origin and destination uh, countries. So if I show my parameter here, so if I change my parameter, so say Canada. There is one thing, this make line function, it creates geodesic lines, which creates curve lines if the data points are farther apart in on the map. If it is very close by, it will create straight lines. So let's format this a bit. So I'll just create a, I'll create a dual axis to just to add a points and select this and I'll make the destination instead of the line and synchronize, make a dual axis. Now we have our uh, destination points and maybe we can color it a bit. Uh, to save time, I have already created the dashboard with formatting. So what we will do is uh, I will create a, another piece with a list of countries and I will club this together. So if, uh, if, if with parameterization action, if I select, I can select a different as country as my origin and the rest of will be my destinations. Another use case of make point function could be if you have two data sets, uh, one is your data set and another is your special file and your data set has latitude and longitudes, you can connect you can use those in a joint condition. For example, here I'm, I'm connecting my special neighborhood information and the uh, San Francisco Police Department uh, data set and I'm uh, intersecting these two data set via geometry and a make point function. So with this make point function, it will create me a geometry so that we can connect the special file and our data set. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please comment. I will be happy to help you guys. Thank you very much.